Hello beautiful people, welcome back to another day of the home workout challenge. Today, I hope you're ready to get sweaty. We are doing a full body workout, cardio workout. It's going to be great, it's going to be great. It's day eight and we didn't come to play, we didn't come to play. We're in week two, you made it this far, you can do this. Today's workout was a bit quicker pace, we're not having quite as much rest as usual, but I believe in you, you can do it. So proud of you for showing up for another day. Let's give it our best. You ready? Let's go. Starting with a warm up as usual. <sighs> Let's go. So we're gonna side lunge with an arm swing, touching each foot as we go. So just moving, easing ourselves into today. Open chest, nice big wide arms. Swing side to side, squeezing the glutes just a little, the thighs just a little, but just stretching out the hips. And then we're going to come up and do some knee hugs. So hug the knee into the chest, stretching out the hamstrings a little, alternating as we go with a nice gentle march. Keep good posture, nice and tall. Deep breathing. Trying to get the knee a little higher up each time. You can actually visibly notice my knee getting higher up as I go. All right, then we're gonna bring it around town with some uh, hip, hip circles. So just do what you feel basically. So pushing back, you're gonna be stretching the hamstrings and the glutes and the calves more. Pushing forward getting a little quad stretch, a little lower back. Let's just listen to your body wherever's tight, focus on that. Awesome, and leaning over, holding your feet, keeping a slight bend in the knee, and we're gonna come up onto our tiptoes and reach nice and tall. Big stretch, come back down, stretching the hamstrings. You can bend the knee as you will, leading the hips back to exaggerate the stretch before we roll back up onto our tiptoes, standing nice and tall. And just repeat that. Try and get your hands all the way to the floor. You can put them flat if you want. You can shift from side to side. Again, just listening to your body as we get that full stretch and we come up nice and tall, reaching the arms, shoulders down, on the tiptoes. And we're gonna jog on the spot, doing circles with the arms, going forward. Nice gentle jog, getting the heart rate up a bit. And arms back the other way. Awesome, and relax. So the first move that we're gonna do will be in and out. So we're lifting the knee up in front, then out to the side, then back to the front, then switching to the other leg. So doing that with a nice skip. Beginners, we are just walking through the movement. Ready? Go. So bring the knee nice and high. Front, out, front. Front, out, front. So the aim of this movement is not only to get that quick high knee, but actually to isolate the leg in the movement. So really opening up the hip, trying to keep the shoulders facing forward. Beginners, we're doing the same, just walking through that movement. A few more, keep going. And 10 seconds rest, which is gonna go quick. And we're moving on to plyometric lunges. So jumping, switching in the air, uh, from side to side, beginners, we are walking through the lunges and go. So try and get as much height as you can, but be controlled with it. So as you land, the weight goes through the heel of the foot in front, 
switching legs like scissors in the ear, good posture, core nice and tight. Beginners we're still getting a really good workout. As we walk through the lunges, keep going. Legs might feel a little jelly, but keep trying to get a nice plyometric jump as we switch. And rest for 10 seconds. Next exercise will be one, two, threes. So high knees, literally counting one, two, three and holding every third. We're skipping through the movement. Beginners, we're walking through and go. So you can really find your rhythm with this. One, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three. Just holding every third, chest nice and high, knees coming all the way through, driving the arms. Good technique, good form. Really getting that knee lifted. Again, as you're still holding every third, core tight, chest up. And rest. Next up are some squat jumps with a foot clap. So clapping your feet together, mid-air, um, intermediate and advanced beginners. We're doing simple squats and go. So being explosive with the movement, jumping up nice and high. You have to get really high to be able to clap your feet at the bottom. Beginners, you're sitting back, weight through the heels. And driving up as you squeeze the glutes and bring the hips back up. Intermediate and advanced. Really trying to get as high as possible, nice and explosive. Weight through the heels, chest up. Keep going. And rest, well done, catch your breath for 10 seconds. Next move we're doing will be some sidewalk planks. So in the plank position, ready and go. You wanna imagine that you've got a tall glass of wine on your back <laughs> and you don't wanna spill it. So you've gotta really hold your core and keep your back level as you move from side to side. If you have more space than me, then take more steps each side. Just take the same amount of steps in each direction. Keeping good posture, we're working the arms, the legs and the core, staying nice and stable. Do not spill that glass of wine on your back. Staying nice and steady, well done. And rest for 10 seconds. Then we're doing some sidewalk squats. And go, staying nice and low, weight through the heels, sitting back. We're just going to walk from side to side. Keep your chest up. Really getting a good burn in the legs, especially after all the plyometric movements we've just done. Try and stay nice and low. It's easy to forget and come up, but try and stay low. Doing really well, just a few more. and rest for 10, well done. Then moving on to skip and twist. So skipping from one leg to the other, bringing a nice high knee, ready and go. So knee to elbow, beginners simply walking through the movement. So the aim is to try and get your knee towards your elbow. Um, the way I want you to do this is not by bringing your elbow down, I want your chest lifted. Try and get that knee nice and high, a good twist in the waist. Working those obliques. Keeping good form. Doing really well, just a few more. Keep going, you can do it. And rest. Well done, then we're gonna move on to some mountain climbers. So down on the plank position. Beginners walking through that movement and go. So knees up up to the chest, keeping a nice engaged core, hands below shoulders, keep it moving, doing really well. Five more seconds, five, four, three, two, and rest well done 
After 10 seconds, we're gonna come and hold a plank. Okay, so beginners, you can come down onto your knees. We're gonna go for 50 seconds and go. So keeping good form, making sure that your bottom's not sticking up in the air, feel free to adjust. Elbows below shoulders, core engaged. Straight legs if you can. You're doing really well, keep going guys. I know that we're pushing ourselves today. You're more than capable, keep going. Try as hard as you can. If you do need to come down, try and pop back up. Five more seconds. And rest, well done, absolutely smashed it. So we've got like a decent amount of rest now. I want you to take the full two minutes. If you're advanced and you wanna push yourself, feel free to cut down this rest, but I recommend you take the full two minutes, grab a drink, have a stretch, wipe your sweated brow, and then we'll come back into the workout. I hope you've had a chance to catch your breath and grab a drink. Getting straight back into it with some in and out. So high knee in front, out to the side, back in front for 35 seconds, skipping through it. Go. So knee up in front, out to the side, back up in front. Up, out, up, up, out, up. Skipping from one leg to the other, staying nice and tall, that knee coming nice and high, really driving all the way through. Trying to allow the knee to come out. You might be limited by your mobility a little bit, that's okay. Beginners walking through that movement, still getting a good workout in. Chest lifted. And rest for 10. Next move we're gonna do will be the plyo lunges. So jumping lunges, switching from leg to leg, beginners walking through, ready and go. Getting as high as you can, scissors in the air. Legs feeling a little bit like jelly, but keep going. Weight through the heel of the leg in front. You're doing really well, guys. Beginners, alternating legs as we go. Lunging forward, coming nice and low, squeezing the glutes, hamstrings, quads. And rest for 10 seconds. And we're gonna go into the sidewalk squat. And go, staying nice and low, walking from side to side. Keep going, you can do it. So try and stay low, I know it's tough, I know your legs feel like jelly, I feel it too. Chest up.
Weight through the heels, hips are back. And rest for 10 seconds. We're going to come down and do some mountain climbers. So plank position, hands below shoulders. And go. Knees coming up to the chest, really driving nice and high. Quick changeover. Beginners, we're walking through that movement. Keep going. Deep breathing. You can do it. So we're getting a really good cardio workout in here, nice and breathless. Just a few more. And rest, well done, that was so good. Then we're gonna do some squat jumps with the foot clap as we are in the air, beginners squatting and go. Now this, this is a little jelly, but you can do it. So jumping as high as you can. You can slow down if you need to, but try not to stop. So weight through the heels, chest lifted, clapping the feet at the top of the jump. Trying to be as explosive as you can. Just a few more, you're doing so well. And rest. <laughs> I feel that. Cool, then we're going to finish this workout. This is the last one. The last one. Plank and go. Beginners, just on your knees. But still keeping the core engaged. Elbow below shoulder, making sure the bottom isn't sticking up in the air. Feel free to adjust, keep going. You're doing so well, nearly there, nearly completed the workout. Five, four, three. And you've done it, well done, well done. You've done so well, you guys. Oh, so proud of you. I will see you back here, same place, same time tomorrow. Bye. <laughs>